Good evening everyone. Um, today it's Friday, May 12th, 2023. Spent my day editing some videos, and did some more photo shoots for Pocket Dungeon. Now I get three expansion packs, um, images that, re that I can use for um, thumbnails when I am ready to upload the files on Cold Street and Etsy. Last night I also managed to print the barrel for Dice Pepper Box. It's actually a bit beefier than what I expected. It'd be great if, if it's a bit slimmer. But for now I'm just gonna wait and see how it all gonna look how it's how it's all gonna look um, when they're all assembled my printer is also still busy printing more parts for this pepper box um, I think by tomorrow we'll have most of the parts ready for um, um, for assembly so that's what I've done today. I also realized um, since this uh, weapon is meant to be used using the same dice shell from the dice pistol and I, I got plenty of that sh um, shell already, I tried to fit test uh, into this barrel and I realized that it's a, thick, a tad bit too tight so my suspicion is that um, the calibration of my 3D printer is off again and then the cube calibration I kind of already suspected it when I um, had some fitting problem with my pocket dungeon uh, some parts is really some parts are too especially the pegs are too big to fit into the, the pocket dungeon board but i think if i recalibrate the, the 3d printer now in the middle of printing all the parts i think the measurement will be far off so for now i'm just gonna wait until i printed all the parts for dice paper box and only after that I'm gonna recalibrate my printer again um, I don't know if I didn't really pay attention before or this have this has ever happened um, already that my 3d printer suddenly off calibration again um, I think that's something that I need to research as well if your 3D printer can uh, how should I say like can um, lose its accuracy, accuracy over time so yeah that's my update for today um, what else there's nothing else um, yeah see you tomorrow